Hey guys, how's it going? So today we're going to be unboxing another fishing reel. So let's open this without any further ado because I'm pretty excited. I wanted this reel. I mean, this reel is the cheapest from Shimano. I do have the Shimano Elder Baron as well as the Shimano Kurado K. I also have this old Bantam Shimano which I don't use anymore. But this one, I got this because my Kurado K, I've sent back to Shimano because the brake disc, I believe, or was it? Yeah, I think it's the brake disc. So yeah, I bought this for me to use in replace of my Kurado K while it is at the workshop. I mean Shimano with I've sent it back to Shimano. So, you know, they're gonna take months. That is why I bought this one. This is the Shimano Chaos. You know what? Let me just open this quick and then I'll resume the video. Okay, so here is the Shimano KS151. Um, I'm not very happy about the dented box because I like my boxes clean and just in spiffy condition. But I mean, it's the reel that counts. So let's just check out some of these specs over here. Nylon mono. Um, I will not be using nylon. I will be using braided line, which is downstairs. I didn't bring it up, but yeah, whatever. Let's open this baby up because, oof, let's check. There's, oh, we've got some free gifts over here. I did not order these, so thank you, seller. Over here, we have the uh, Shimano's warranty card. You don't have to see that. So here is the real, beautiful, can't wait to open it. All right, so we have some braking. I think this is the centrifugal braking things that are, yep, the spare ones. So we'll keep that in the box. I think this is, oh, that's the manual of the reel if you want to take it out and assemble it, disassemble it to service it, I don't know, but I'm not going to be doing that because I suck at doing these things. And of course, every reel, I mean, the ones that I bought from Shimano, you get this Bantam oil, which is, yeah, their maintenance oil. They recommend to use that and not any other real oil, so that's what we're going to be using to service this, if it needs servicing. All right, so let's get it out of the bubble wrap and, oh, hell yeah, man, hell yeah. Now that is a beauty. So over here it's written genuine warranty product. If my phone would focus, there we go, you can see it. And dang, it looks good, it looks good, man. It looks pretty nice. I mean, I got it super cheap. I think I got it for about $60. Yeah, I got it for about $60 and oh, it's made in Malaysia. Uh, I want the Shimano reels that are made in Japan because my Elder Baron is made in Japan and I just believe that the Japanese ones are better because Shimano is from Japan. But I mean, I guess the, the Malaysian one works as well. Yeah, I don't know, but I think it's good. Yeah, I will be using this as my everyday reel until I get back my Kurado. So yeah, now I'm gonna go and spool up my line. Oh, nice. There's like glitter down here. I think this reel looks pretty sleek for, I mean, I love this, this arrow head. Looks very, very aggressive. I've just become a Shimano guy and the KS is the cheapest one and I'm really excited to actually test how this thing performs. But that will be in another video. So I don't know. I'll go and spool this up and be right back. Oh yeah, before I do that, there is one thing that I don't really like about this reel. It's over here. You see this, this phone focus, focus. I don't know what's wrong with my phone, but yeah, you see over here, this is plastic. And this material of plastic scratches really, really quickly as you can see. So yeah, I'm not a fan of my reels being scratched. I don't like scratched up reels. And this kind of material, this matte kind of plastic thing, it scratches really, really bad. I mean, this is just brand new and you can already see scratches. Yep. Not a big fan of that. But I mean, what are you gonna expect from a $60 reel, right? So there we go, guys. We have got the line on and I think it looks pretty awesome. It would have looked better if they had some black braided line, but they only had green, white, and yellow. And I think green would be the best out of those three. So yeah, I think it looks pretty good. By the way, I didn't mention that this reel is the 6 to 3, 6.3 to 1 gear ratio, which is over there. If my phone would focus, there we go. 6.3 to 1 gear ratio, as well as 5 kilo or 11 pound drag, maximum drag. So yeah, I think this reel looks pretty sleek especially on the rod but with this it's a rod that I've never really used before because of the handle I'm not really a fan of this handle I bought this because it looks pretty unique but I think yeah it looks pretty good in my opinion would I get another if this one goes spoiled yep definitely because this I mean for $60 it feels awesome despite the cheap plastic thingy which scratches I don't know if it's cheap but it, it probably scratches like a hell of a lot so yeah like I mentioned not a fan of that but I mean all in all for a $60 reel I 
think it looks way better than any other $60 reel out there because Shimano, you guys are awesome. So yeah, that will be it for this video. Just showing you guys this reel, this new awesome slick looking reel. I mean, look at that. Is that not badass or not? And yeah, we'll be trying this reel out in maybe next week. Yeah, I think we'll be trying this reel out next week. And... <laughs> Really, Xena? Why'd you gotta bark when I'm filming every time? So yeah, we'll be trying this reel out next week and we'll see how that goes. Till then, you guys take care and peace. Actually costs pretty well without any bird's nest. That's awesome. Line retrieve is pretty smooth as well. So yeah, can't wait to get out on the water with this.